what's up it's amber and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here and if you are new here you should definitely subscribe so for today's video i'm gonna be doing a po unboxing i figured i would just dedicate a quick vlog to just opening some mail from you guys i have quite the haul today we got a lot of stuff. I'm gonna be saving this big boy for last because I know exactly what it is and I'm so excited to open it and show you guys. Before we get started, I'm just gonna do shout out of the week real quick. And this week's shout out goes to Brandon here on YouTube. This comment was literally so sweet. Shout out to you, boo. And without further ado, let's get into the haul. Okay, so I have a few letters here and I'm gonna start with the letters. This one has a cute little winter looking sticker on it. So we're gonna pick this one first. It is from Cassidy and Cassidy's actually sent me a couple of letters before. Her handwriting is so cute. And she even wrote, sprayed the letter with cloud. Hi Amber, I'm so happy to be writing to you again. For Christmas, I asked for your Ratchet merch tee in pink. I did get it, but with something else I wasn't expecting. You sent me the other Ratchet shirt in gray. I can't believe that happened. I love you. I have slash had a feeling you know who I am. Of course I do. On Christmas Day, I opened your pink packaging and was only expecting one, but to my surprise, received each color share of your Ratchet merch. I cried way too much. I said, I think Amber finally knows who I am now. Oh my God, yes, of course I do. By the time you get this, it'll be my birthday or past it. It's on New Year's. So my mom bought me your blue moon crew neck for my birthday. By then I'll have half of your merch. I can't thank you enough for being so open with your fans. Again, you saved 2020 for me, period. By the time you get this, I'll be watching the video in my blue moon crew neck. That's literally the cutest ever. I hope you have a happy and safe New Year's. Love you, boo. XOXO, Cassidy. That is literally the cutest thing ever. This letter literally made my day. I knew that opening these would make my day start off really great because, I don't know, let's sidetrack for a minute. I've just been trying to like take a little bit of a break from vlogging every day. I haven't been doing daily vlogs. As you guys have probably noticed, I've uploaded just one so far this year. And that's kind of why I wanted to take it back and kind of just like make a PO unboxing, something that's like nice and relaxing and not so much stress. Not that vlogging is stressful, but it can get stressful because I, the way I am in my head, I want every vlog to be so perfect in a certain way. And when it doesn't happen, I get really discouraged and I get so like flustered, you know? I'm trying to just take a step back and really just kind of like think about what content I want to do. I've just been in a weird like foggy headspace lately just due to a lot of stuff going on in my personal life. I just knew that sitting down and filming this video and reading your guys' letters would make me feel better and it definitely already is working. Shout out to Cassidy. Happy belated birthday. I love you so much. So the next letter is from Adriona. I also know who this is. She made an account on Instagram called Sweet Like Greaves. It was like one of my first fan accounts ever and I'm just so thankful for her support and I've missed her a lot. So let's see what she has to say. She made this adorable letter. Oh my God, it says, I love you, happy new year. Hey Amber, it's Adriana. Happy new year, I love you so much. I hope 2021 treats you with all happiness, love, and joy. I hope you're doing well. Give Tundi a hug and kiss for me. I love you both so much. Also, thank you for everything you do for me and for getting me through 2020, which was a very difficult year for all of us. And I'm glad that we all finally have gotten through it. My mental health has been bothering me lately, but you have taught me just get rid of those negative people out of my life because I really don't need them. I'm very thankful for you and your YouTube videos because without these things, I don't know where I would be again. Thank you for being and having such a sweet and kind heart. Love, Adriana. Oh my God, she's literally the cutest. Yes, if you are ever going through something where you feel like external forces are making you feel some certain type of way, whether it's anxious or upset or mad, anything other than what you wanna be feeling, definitely just reevaluate. And if it's something that you don't need in your life, get rid of it. If it's something that's just causing a burden and it's not like doing you any good, just cut it out. And I know it's sometimes really hard, but at the end of the day, you just need to look at yourself and be like, you know what? I deserve this. Like I deserve peace and I deserve happiness. So why not do whatever it takes to get that? You know, sometimes it sucks. Cause if you have really good friends in your life that are just really toxic and you know, you've tried everything that you can to do what you can to help make them better. Then at that point, it's kind of like, you just gotta let them do their thing. And if they come back to you someday when they've gotten all their together and kind of like dealt with their own problems the way they need to be, then the time will be right. And hopefully you can have a really good friendship or a relationship depends whoever you're talking about I don't know but um yeah just definitely just try to keep the negativity away because I know personally I have enough negative thoughts in my head and enough problems that I deal with internally that I don't need to take on somebody else's problems too and help them deal with that you know what I mean like I will gladly help you deal with your problems but I'm not gonna fix them for you like that's something we all have to do ourselves I don't know food for thought also I'm like switching up the new angle because I kind of wanted natural daylight and I wanted to sit over here on the floor but now my knees 
knees are hurting, so that was not the smartest. All right, this looks gorgeous. This is from Katiana. She is actually someone that I realized lives really close to Timmy, so hopefully I'll get to meet her someday. Oh my God, stop it. You're gonna die. Hi, Amber, I wanted to send you a little Christmas gift, so I hope you like it. I hope you had a great Christmas, and I wish you and your family a happy new year. Hopefully 2021 treats us better than 2020. Love you lots, Kat. So Kat also started a YouTube channel recently, and if you guys want, you should check it out. Her videos are so cute, and she's just such a beautiful, nice person. But she sent a Lauren Conrad ring and necklace. This is the most cute thing ever. And then this is my birthstone for August. Oh my God, I literally can't wait to wear this. It has like little beads that move around in it. So that is the ring. It's an adorable little heart. I love it so much. I'm gonna put it on my pinky on this finger since I don't have any rings. That is so cute. And then the necklace I'll wear later because I already have a necklace on. It's the necklace that I got for Christmas for my cousin Haley and it says my name on it. I love it. But this is literally such a sweet gift. Thank you so much, Kat. I love you. Make sure you guys go check out her channel. I know I've said it a million times. So that's it for the letters. Now I'm gonna move on. I have a couple of packages. We will just start with this gorgeous little rose gold package here. It has stick all over it. This one is from Illinois. It doesn't say a name though. Ooh, pink packaging inside. Someone knows the way to my heart. It's a little photo album for Polaroids. Oh, I've been wanting one of these so bad. It has a gorgeous card. This is giving me like Beauty and the Beast vibes with the roses. So this one says, Amber, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Here's a little something for you. I'm a big fan of your channel and Instagram accounts. I feel like we are friends in real life and I've enjoyed getting to know you through social media. I agree. That's how I feel about all of you guys whenever I get to talk with you and have little conversations whether it's in the comments back and forth or whether it's in my messages on Instagram I just really feel like we are friends and I consider you guys my friends and my family also thank you for being such a light for me this past year life sucks sometimes True that. I literally want to put that on a shirt. Take care, babe. XO, always Alex. P.S. I hope you don't think I'm weird, but I put a Polaroid selfie in the album from when I went to Sweetener Tour Chicago. I was lit, LOL. Oh my God, I am living. Let me see. Oh my God, wait, no. She's literally the cutest. So that is Alex at Sweetener Tour Chicago. Oh my God, that is literally, she's got a NASA shirt on. We literally stan and then she has polaroid film skin message memo pattern i've never had these before this is literally like the most sweet thoughtful thing ever shout out to alex thank you so much for being so supportive and for sticking by my side all this time because truly i literally would not be able to be still going without you guys i really mean that Okay, this is actually one of the best drawings I've ever seen. It's a drawing of me the day that I wore my hair like this, inspired by Ari, and I took that picture. Oh my God, that's literally the most detailed, beautiful drawing I've like ever seen. I feel like it's prettier than me. I feel like it looks like me if I were in like an animated movie. That is so gorgeous. I'm gonna need to get a frame for that. And then in here, we also have some little goodies. It looks like some Christmas goodies. This one says Tundi on it, so I'm gonna have to give that to Tundi. And then this one says Amber, to Amber. I'm sorry for my bad handwriting. It's not bad, trust me, I can read anything. I just wanted to say thank you. You have helped me through one of my darkest times this year. Watching your videos makes me smile and made me start to focus on myself. I wish we could be best friends. Hopefully you'll come back on Twitter whenever you do, even if it's five years or a month, no matter what, I'll always be there for you. Oh, that's so sweet. Thank you for making me smile with every new video and past video you have. I hope Tundi loves her gift. I also hope you love the drawing I did of you. I love drawing and wanted to draw people who inspire me. I can't wait to see what you do for 2021. I hope you have the best rest of the year. I love you so much. Hopefully we can meet one day and give Tundi a hug for me. P.S. If you ever need to talk, I'm always here for you. Oh, and your family is the coolest. I love when you're making your toast or cooking with them. That is so cute. Let's open these little gifts now. Oh my gosh. Okay, so the first one is a donut ornament. So I'm gonna have to save this for next year to put on my tree. This is gonna look so good because it goes with my pink theme. Oh my gosh, wait, and there's stickers. Ari stickers from at swall underscore art on Instagram. Ooh, what the heck? Look at these stickers. That is iconic. There's an I'm so successful on candy hearts. There are some outer space ones. We have a UFO that says, take me away. Uh, yeah, I'm about to put this on my window so they can see it. Oh, we see humans, but no humanity. Ain't that the truth? The light is coming. We stand. I'm about to put all these on my computer. I am literally in shock. Oh my 
my gosh, she got Tandy this little rope toy. I cannot wait to show her. She is going to love it. She loves throwing stuff around. Like I feel like she'll just whip this around. Okay, so that is it for everything from Liv. Oh my God, I literally, I literally cannot even deal. This is has me in shock. I cannot believe how talented she is. Thank you, Liv. Shout out to you, literally the sweetest. So this next package is actually from Honeymoon & Co. One of my viewers messaged me saying that he sent me something from Honeymoon & Co. And I was like, don't spend your money on me. Please, like do not spend your money on me. I don't want you guys to spend your hard earned money on buying things for me. You guys should treat yourself and buy things for yourself. But since he did, I am of course beyond thankful. And I'm so excited to see what's in here. Oh my gosh. Okay, so first of all, it comes with the little positive reminder card, which I stan. I absolutely love every single thing that Honeymoon & Co. stands for. They're all about self-care. They're so nice and kind and inclusive to anyone who's a fan of them. And I just love how they put these in there. Like it's so important. You never know. Someone might be having the worst day and they might open up this package and read this and it might be a real turning point you know and this is the just like magic bag that I have been wanting so bad but I could not just justify randomly buying it for myself I am literally obsessed it says just like magic manifest it a public service announcement by honeymoon and co and then on the back it says just like magic I get everything I want because I attract it great things are coming to me I am worthy and deserving that is something that we should all be saying every single day you know you should wake up in the morning and look in the mirror and think that you are great and that you do deserve everything I know I've repeated this a lot throughout my videos but at the end of the day all you really have is yourself yes you might have a best friend like I have Timmy that I talk to 24 7 Lulu my sisters my family but at the end of the day all you really have is yourself and all you're really in control of is yourself so why not give yourself the world like for example whenever I'm with a significant other or something like that I always want to give them the world I want to buy them gifts I want to tell them I love them I want to tell them they're great and amazing and I'm like why wouldn't you do that to yourself you know like your your relationship with yourself should definitely be the first and most important because if you can't take care of yourself alone then then it's gonna make it harder for someone else to like help take care of you. You know what I mean? I don't know if that makes sense. That's just the way I look at it. Of course, I think it's situational. Every situation is, is different, but I definitely think that we all should be giving ourselves some love. So that's also another reason why I love Honeymoon & Co. Cause they're all about self love. Oh, Dundee's here. Hi baby. Look, someone got you a toy. Oh, she likes it. <laughs> She's such a good girl. Oh, go get it. Look at the toy. Oh my gosh, she's playing with it. Let me see. <laughs> you love your toy from Liv? Oh, that is so cute. Good girl. Oh my god. Told you she likes to whip things around. Oh, well, Tundi's gonna sit there and play with her toy. So I just went through my messages and I figured out who sent this. It was one of my viewers, Almog, and he is literally the sweetest ever. He orders literally like all of my merch. I've talked with him and his mom. They're both literally the sweetest people ever. And he did message me on January 4th telling me that he was sending me a package from Honeymoon Co. and to open it on camera. So shout out to you, boo. I definitely want to use this bag when I go grocery shopping and when I go pick up my P.O. box stuff. I can just throw it all in here and have a little P.O. box bag. I think that would be so cute. I can't believe how nice and thoughtful you guys are. Like, it literally blows my mind. So this last package, I'm very excited to open for you guys. It is from a small business that reached out to me that asked if I would open some merch to kind of like get their business out there. And I was like, of course, I am so beyond excited to see what it looks like. First of all, the packaging is so nice. I love that it comes packaged in its own little bag. This first one is the Off the Table crew neck, and I have had that song stuck in my head literally all day. It's so weird. This is what it looks like. It's white. It has a little lyric from Off the Table. It says, will I ever love the same way again? Am I too cold? Am I not nice? Can I still love you? Just wanted to know, is love completely off the table? And I love how it has XOXO. It honestly looks like the XO that The weekend does. Like, that's his little logo. And then, look at this sleeve. Isn't that the most gorgeous thing you've ever seen? Oh, I can't even get over it. And then I think that is it. I think that's all that's on it. I was nervous to get white, but like the white really just looked so cute to me. That is the off the table one. The quality is so good. And this is like on there. Like that's not coming off. I'm impressed. This next one, you guys are going to die. This next one is the nasty crew neck. And they actually said that this one is one of their favorites. So I was very excited to see it. Oh my God. I cannot even deal right now. It's like a movie. It's like a movie title. And down below it says KK 
& Co, which is the brand, AG6, Ariana Grande Nasty, Toulouse Grande, Coco, Cinnamon, Myron Grande, Piggy Smalls, Strauss, Lafayette, Pignoli, oh my god, Snape, Dalton, and Ariana Grande. I am so shook right now at the amount of detail that they put into this. Then look at the back. Oh my god, I can't even. It says, the following preview has been approved to accompany this feature, like you would see for an R-rated movie. Film advertised has been rated R. And it says KK & Co, again, their business. And it says, don't want to wait on it. Oh my god. That is literally the cutest thing ever. I want to put it on right now. This is definitely my favorite. Even though I love this one so much, I definitely think the nasty one is my favorite. Ooh, oh my gosh. Okay, that is the cutest thing ever so they also put a little note and it says you're such a dream amber thank you so much for your support we are so excited and passionate about what we're doing here sending you love and light k and k so the girls actually gave me a discount code if you want to shop their shop just use code amber 10 for 10 percent off and i will have them linked down below where you guys can check them out their website is so cute and i'm just so thankful that they reached out to me and wanted me to open their stuff it literally means the world to me if you guys have a small business that you're trying to get any sort of exposure for i don't have the biggest platform but i will use it the best that I can so if you guys have a small business that you want out there feel free to DM me and I would be glad to work together on that but yeah huge shout out to K and K my girls thank you so much for thinking of me and for sending me these things I'm just like I cannot wait to wear these 24 7 I'm so obsessed so definitely go check them out again I'll have it all linked down below even the discount code so go check them out all right you guys well that is it for my PO unboxing haul today I hope you enjoyed it comment down below what other videos you guys want to see I promise I will be back to doing daily vlogs very very soon make sure you guys are following me on Instagram and TikTok because I am pretty active over there when I'm not on YouTube shout out to everyone who sent me something today I seriously am so overwhelmed with how well you guys know me and with how thoughtful you are and just like I always am in awe whenever I open stuff for my PO box huge shout out to you guys I love you so much I hope everyone's having an amazing 2021 so far and if you're not it's okay there's a new day tomorrow that you can start and wake up and make it whatever you want so just don't feel discouraged but yeah, that is it for this video. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.